I can't, shouldn't, I'm not gonna, I'm, ah, screw it. Exactly what small ones are supposed to do. Jump. Look at that dude inhaled the champ's car. This little bait, man. I probably own about no less than 600 different craws. So it takes a lot in a craw to just really excite me. And I'll tell you what, when I first got a package of these, I was like, that yeah, looks cool, I'll give it a shot. But when I put it in the water, I knew it was gonna be part of my repertoire moving forward. You know, there is a ton of baits that look good in a package, but when you put them in the water, they just don't live up to what you expected. This bad boy does. This literally comes to life under the water. I've never seen a bait that you can quiver so much and, and those claws, I mean, they just sit up in that defense mechanism. That's what a crayfish does. I mean, you wanna wonder what a crayfish does? Right before a bass eats a crayfish, it's the last thing it does. It's its feeble attempt at defending itself. And that makes bass hungry. And a bait that does that is truly a lethal, lethal member of your fishing repertoire. Repertoire. It's a word you don't hear a lot in fishing shows. We're gonna bring it back. My repertoire runs deep. Get in here, Junior. Just a little dude. Big, little, it don't matter. Once those sexy little claws start waving, fish got no choice. They gotta start munching. Here he is. Smoked it. Easy. Come here, dude. Oh, there we go. There's a net on that, dude. Man, look at that fish right there. He inhaled that little crawdaddy. And so he should. If you ask me, a bass's favorite forage is right there. Little crayfish. I mean, there are crayfish up north, the crawfish down south, no matter where you go in the world, they are bass food. Smoked it. Oh man, it's a good one too. Look at that fish. <laughs> man, just the, the, what you can do with this bait totally changes the way. I mean, like, before this, I didn't fish a lot of crawfish and shaky head style baits. You know, it's usually a Texas rig type bait. But man, once you see how this thing looked on a shaky head, oh, it's tough to throw anything else. That is a chunk. That dude could not, oh easy, that dude could not say no to the quiver of the champ's craw. It's just crazy the way that bait just quivers. Down. There is that little bad boy. I mean, the way that bait sits up under the water and the way you can just quiver that bait, I mean, just sitting there like this, fish will come up and stare at it and you see them slowly moving in. You know, they'll come in, 
and they'll kind of stop a few feet away they get closer and closer and as that bait quivers they have no choice they're just like i got they, you, get, they have to i can't shouldn't i'm not gonna I'm, ah screw it 